part of preparing for a hurricane is trying to take care of my plants as best I can. I've never really had to do this before, so I was winging it. But I have a, this is a reaper, Carolina reaper pepper. And some plants I know will survive this hurricane and almost thrive because of it, but the reapers aren't one of them, I don't think. So what I did was I took some of my plastic pink stuff tape and just tried to wrap all the branches such that the majority of the plant is this nice tight kind of uh, thing I don't know and I, I thought about taking off some of these peppers but they're not quite ready and I wanted just to see if they would last but I just tried to wrap my plants as best I could so that the majority of the branches kind of all tucked in and that I, I may lose some leaves I'm just hoping I can save the plant and it would be a bonus if I could save a few peppers. So besides picking up the yard and making sure everything is put away and strapped down and tied down, this is how I, I took care of the pepper plants. And if y'all have a better way of doing this, please let me know because when, although we had a week's notice on the hurricane, sometimes that's just not enough. With all the other things that goes into hurricane prep, this was one of the last things I had time to do. And I did this as best I, as best I could as not ever having had to think about it before. So if y'all know of a better way, please let me know. Here's another one of my hot pepper plants, um, very much wrapped like the one before it. I don't think there's any peppers on here, maybe, maybe a small one, but we just tried to wrap these so we could contain the branches and save as many of the leaves as possible. This is, this is kind of what we're hoping, and we're hoping that when we come, they're, they're standing. We've reinforced some with stakes and crossing our fingers.